I like the fact that we get to see other scenes. We don't have to be in the scene to see it. Again, something they can they kind of learn from Gen Z. Okay, the fox is calling us again. <sighs> Madam Yukong has asked me to look after you. Seems like we were destined to be in each other's company. The Skyfaring Commission has reserved rooms for you at the Petrichor Inn. When you finish your business here, how about some tea together? Easy. I know this probably brings back bad memories. <sighs> well, here we are. I feel sleepy already. Is Elsa here? Oh, what? But we've done a whole day's work. What's the sun playing at? It felt like we spent the whole day in the Palace of Astrum. Uh, jokes aside, did you see Madame Yukong frown at us? I thought her guards were about to jump out of nowhere and throw us in jail. <sighs> I'd rather deal with monsters than these big shots. Uh, I mean, not that Madame Yukong doesn't have her merits. <laughs> Don't worry, my lips are sealed. But as her subordinate, I have to say that it's Madame Yukong's duty to keep her guard up. The Law Fu is facing a crisis, and as head of the Skyfaring Commission, she is responsible for the security of the Sienjo's customs and borders. She's actually a very reasonable old girl in private. That many years ago, Madame Yukong was an ace pilot in the Cloud Knights. She was a work hard, play harder type, known for her hot temper and incredible skill. Eventually, she became the head of the entire commission, which required her to learn patience and adopt a meticulous approach to her work. In any case, Madame Yukong instructed me to reserve the best rooms at the inn and have all your expenses covered. She wants to extend the full courtesy of the Sienjo so that all of you enjoy your stay to the fullest. She specifically mentioned that if you wish to buy anything at the inn, be it food or otherwise, just let the innkeeper know. The commission will cover the cost. you go back yourself <clears throat> seeing as our hosts are so thoughtful I guess we should help ourselves right mr. Yang we should focus on our objective first seeing as Helmmaster Yukong was extremely reluctant to get us involved am I right to speculate that the Skyfaring Commission has some leads on the whereabouts of Kafka exactly right the suspect is extremely cunning. She encrypted her transmission and timed her communication. We couldn't pinpoint her exact location. But as cunning as she is, the Divination Commission has managed to find something. Oh, hey, Captain. Here are the coordinates. It's up to you how to proceed. Well, that was easy. Destinations may differ, but the orbits of the stars will eventually converge. See you later. And shouldn't we, you know, discuss this inside doors to say?
don't let her words distract you. That's the sound of a device. Uh, which means what exactly? This is a starship. There are all kinds of devices making weird noises. He has a point. Miss March, to the untrained ear, these noises may sound the same, but for the craftsmen of the Artisanship Commission, every machine has a different pitch and melody. The General sent for craftsmen, and they concluded that the sound came from the shipyard facilities in Stargazer Navalia. Now, get some rest and prepare yourselves for the operation ahead. I look forward to seeing you in action. Let's take advantage of the rest. It won't be easy to track down Kafka the Stellaron Hunter. Oh, let's let the Express know how we're doing. More importantly, let's see how Don Hung's doing. <laughs> Ask him what he's up to. Then tell him we're having loads of fun. You've been standing here for half an hour. It's rare to see you like this. Are you worried about those two? Welt is with them. They should be fine. <sighs> Himiko, did you keep a copy of the Stellaron Hunter's transmission? Can I have a look? Sure. Not to mention... 45 system hours ago, a Stellaron birth occurred on the Lafu. An unexpected calamity, don't you think? <sighs> what exactly are you Stellaron hunters trying to do? The Cienjo Alliance aren't us. They won't give you time to explain. Once you draw the attention of the hunt, you become their prey. The Alliance will hunt you to the end of the universe. Stop speaking in riddles, Kafka. Say what you have to say. <sighs> it's simple. That Stellaron has nothing to do with us, but the Sienjo is convinced that we're responsible. Stop! Oh, hey, Blake. Do you know him? The Sienjo is in danger. This man, he... He's his brother. Dun dun. If he's on the ship, then Welt March and her... Everyone is in grave danger. But... Is he... connected to that past you want to escape? I... I can't leave them down there. It's just... I'm afraid my burden has finally caught up with me. And that everyone is about to be drawn in. You don't say it, Dragon. And yeah, based on what we saw in the anime opening, he's become a five star. The game is bay out and we only have altars for these guys. Is there anyone who doesn't carry around a past burden? She may not remember it, but even a girl as carefree as March has hers. We tread on a path that is hidden from us. The things we see and the trails we blaze all become our baggage. They weigh us down, but they also give us strength to continue the journey. Try not to dwell on it, Don Hung. The Express spends seven standard days at each stop. Its passengers are allowed to do as they deem fit during that time. Pom Pom and I are more than capable of looking after the Express. So, wait, so in three, all this happened between a week? Huh, 
what happens when we say we kind of delay or actually wait i think we actually kind of were late although i think that was more for a comedic effect that actually be but technically we are in a planet for a week or so if there's something you've got to do do it now better than regretting it further down the line And you'll come back and travel with us once this is all over, right? Oh, wow, I can't tell him now. Why did you tell him 46? The hand. Wait, is this my long icon that I put on here? I think this is... Okay, this is definitely not mine than her because I didn't equip this to him. I didn't even find it. You wanna disembark on her? Changed your mind? Well then, Pom Pom wishes you the best of luck. Make sure you return before the express departs. And bring Pom Pom back some local specialties? Can't send the message out. The network is down, but some functions still work. Virtually nothing has changed since I left. Apart from darkness, this place is all that I remember of the Law Fool. Too late to repent. No interesting future. Virtually nothing has changed since I left. Apart from darkness, this place is all that I remember of the law fool. Oh my god. I present you two of most decent opposite to say. The most beloved character versus the most hated character. Okay, I can uh, misremember her name, but the blonde guy is Otto. Everyone loves Otto. Emergencies should be dealt with by professionals. Okay, let's see what we have here. Ah, shoot check. What path are you? Oh, she's a hunter too. Don't hesitate. <laughs> Fighting is meaningless. Wanna see what I can do here? Not going anywhere. You're hurt. It's okay. Phew. This one's Let strong, all right. Truth of life and death. The sanctuary is but a vision. Break. We are not going anywhere. 
merciful Medicus. Fighting is meaningless. Secret of the safe. I've no interest in conflict. No more playing nice. You're not going anywhere. Oof. I'm supposed to actually loot. Oh, thanks, Soto. With you two risking your lives for me, could I really stay where I am? Move carefully. The truth of life in the sanctuary. Story? So we have trial and story now? Immortality means forever. <laughs> the dead return. Too late to repent. <laughs> Let me through. You. So, soy character control the one? I guess so. Take this! Shake, rise, beat it! Are you two okay? Good. I'm Sushong of the Cloud Knights. I was just transferred here from the Yao Ching. Well, I did tell you to let me handle it. I don't have eyes in the back of my head. What if I accidentally hit you? Forgive me, miss, but you were too busy being hit yourself. It's a good thing I joined the fray. <laughs> I was protecting you more like. It's a Cloud Knight's job to protect others. And this area is under martial law. I'm escorting all civilians to safety. Follow me. We're not gonna point out that Otto has a giant thing behind him. That was some impressive Cloud Knight spearmanship. Which unit are you from? Wait, are we controlling that whole chase? Huh. Okay. You're a civilian then. Come with me. Why didn't we say something? Miss Sushang, what exactly has transpired here? In all my trade visits, I've never seen Starskiff Haven in such a state. I, uh, I can't comment on that. I was just ordered to rescue the civilians. Actually, I have no idea either. Anyway, you two just need to come with me. Hey, you're pretty quiet. What's your name? I've got forms to fill out. Can't put your name down as blank. My name is Dan Hung. I'm a traveler. I'm on my way to meet up with my friends. I appreciate the help, but I can leave the port on my own. No can do, mister. It's way too late. You won't find anyone at Starskip Haven. If your friends made it out, then they'll already be in the safe zone. No need to worry. You'll see them when we get there. Aren't you going to take my name too? Miss? You already said it when we were busy fighting. La... something... La Cha! Is that right? <laughs> I remember it. Let's go. Stay close, you two. Cloud Knight Sushong will guarantee your safety. Well, this is on your team map. Thing. I need you to write your names down later. I don't know too many characters. I might make a mistake. Message not sent? Why not? Long range communication technology is still improving. Perhaps the presence of the Stellaron is affecting signal transmission. Doesn't seem like it. Everything else is working fine. See? 
In that case, it looks like someone wants to make things difficult for us. Since Kafka's here, I wouldn't be surprised if this turns out to be that Stellaron Hunter Hacker Girl's handiwork. Think you get away with your crime by pretending to be a waiter? Oh, you've arrived. <laughs> I like your sense of humor, benefactors. Of course I'm happy to see you. When things settle down, I might even get promoted for catching a Stellaron Hunter. Stargazer Navalia is governed by the Artisanship Commission. It took me a while to sort out our paperwork. I got a sense of the situation on my way back. Just like at Cloudford, Stargazer Navalia's Meridian Pin has malfunctioned. The checkpoint there is abandoned, and the garrison is scrambling to locate the Stellaron. With monsters wreaking havoc and the knights scattered, Stargazer Navalia has become a perfect place for the suspect to hide out. <sighs> so we've got a bunch of monsters to deal with, an IPC most wanted Stellaron hunter to catch, and we have to do all that on our own without reinforcements? Well, fair enough. This isn't our first rodeo. I was just making small talk. Never mind the details. I wouldn't say you're entirely on your own. <laughs> when you're ready, let's get going. Shall we, my benefactors? Now what's a hunt without a hound? Kafka is still at large, and the Skyfaring Commission wants this problem to go away. I made a few calls and managed to procure this from the Artisanship Commission. Perfect for hunting down suspects. Oh my god. This is the most adorable Aww, thing ever. He's so cute. Can we keep it? Please, can we keep it? Please, please, please. I want to keep this one. Uh, <clears throat> I mean, what can he do exactly? Are we going to set him loose on Kafka? Yes and no. This is Deeting, a bionic dog developed by the Artisanship Commission. He has all the five senses of the Foxian race and takes them to another level. Wait, this is not a dog and a fox? Again, can we keep it, please, after all this? Oh, look at it, how cute it is. And we really... Actually, no, I don't think we see a dog in Bella but... I think I say that name wrong every time. But yeah, it is a dog, I want to pet it. Be it tracks or scent, as long as he uncovers a trace, he'll follow it all the way to the end. All we need to do is look for any trace left by Kafka. It doesn't matter how good she is at hiding, Deeting will find her. But before we get started, let's play with his settings a bit and get him ready. To begin with, let's set him to scent detection mode. Tell Dating to follow the scent of my perfume and see what he can do. 